hi all and thanks again for tuning in to another episode of Eatin' Out in Vegas. I finally am able to give you an Italian restaurant that is an authentic Italian restaurant without the focus being on pizza. I know I've featured several different pizzerias and I really wanted to give you guys just an Italian restaurant that you could go to. And I've been looking to try to find you guys an experience that isn't going to kill your pocketbook. I've found through just trying to search for something that Italian food is extremely expensive. I'm every place that I've seen and researched, I'm looking at a minimum of $22, $24 a plate and up. And that depends on if you get something with a veal in it or if you get something with a seafood in it and whatnot. Um, but even just the plain pastas I'm finding start at about $22 a plate. So this place that I found today, I found courtesy of Groupon. Now, you know, I'm all for saving some money but at the same time, I want to try new experiences and be able to provide you guys with the same thing. So on Groupon, the offer that they have right now is $30 voucher for $18. So we went ahead, purchased that, and went to Pasta Mia West. It's located at 4455 West Flamingo, and it's at the corner of Arville. They do have a second location that is Pasta Mia East, and it's located on Tropicana. Fantastic place. I honestly cannot wait to go back. I was very, very impressed with the service, the atmosphere, the food. Very, very good. So to start off, you sit down, of course, you get your drinks, and then they give you a bread basket. And it's not just your normal plain bread. They've actually got some herbs and it's buttery and fantastic. And then, of course, you have your oil and your vinegar on the table. Um, the bread was so fantastic. I mean, heck, we could have sat there all night and just eaten nothing but the bread. It was that good. The meal that I chose to have was I chose to get the lasagna bolognese. Huge, huge, huge portion. Fantastic. A lot of cheese, the meat sauce, just great flavor. They also give you um, fresh Parmesan, and so then you can just sprinkle it on there yourself versus like the whole um, Olive Garden type thing where they're shredding it above your plate and kind of getting it all over the place. This place is very, very classy. Definitely worth the money. The dish my husband chose to have was the spaghetti and meatballs. Now, I will say this. I have for quite some time been put off on spaghetti meatballs because my husband makes the best spaghetti in the entire world. I don't care what anybody says. His sauce is what makes spaghetti fantastic. So I find that anytime I go to restaurants, I, I just don't get spaghetti because of that main reason. I just know that it's not going to be to the calibers that my husband is. I like thick sauce and spicy sauce and you know it most places will have a watered down type thinner plain type sauce unless it's like a you know meat sauce um their spaghetti was very good i would definitely get it what put the spaghetti meatballs over the top was the meatballs. Oh my gosh. I don't think that I have ever had a more delicious meatball in my life. 
and I don't even know if I can explain it well enough to portray what the portray accurately what the flavor was. It almost kind of melted in your mouth. It, the just the flavor of it was just out of this world. It was juicy. It stayed together. It didn't like fall apart when you tried to cut it or anything. But then once it was in your mouth, it it just kind of melted. It was, it was just yummy goodness. It, it was fantastic. Very, very impressed with it. And then my daughter had, and I forgive me if I butcher this, she had a penne arrabbiata. And it had a spicy tomato sauce with basil. And again, it was another experience that when you put it in your mouth, you got a little bit of that spice and then you got the basil. And it was just perfect. It was just a perfect flavor combination. The basil was there to enhance. It wasn't there to overwhelm. It wasn't there to be this, the main star of the dish, but at the same time it was because of how they incorporated it in there and the way that the flavors hit your taste buds and at the time that they hit your taste buds was fantastic. So the funny thing was is that I tried my daughter's and just fell in love with hers again because I like spicy and it wasn't overwhelmingly spicy but it just enough just to hit ya and then I tried my husband's and when I tried that meatball again fantastic and then I tried mine <laughs> And I was kind of like, wow, you know, I wish I either had hers or I had his. It's not that my lasagna wasn't good because by all means, it was very good. It's just the experience I got when I tried theirs was different. It was a very unique and, and just like this, this punch, this kind of pow. And so, but, you know, like I said, not knocking my lasagna. My lasagna was fantastic. I did like it. And the portions are plentiful. I mean, they're very big. And so much so that, you know, I didn't finish all of mine. My daughter didn't finish all of hers. And I've always been a firm believer, if you don't finish your meal, you don't get dessert. However, our waiter, Johnny, absolutely fantastic. If you guys go to this place, you must ask for him. Service is on point. Very knowledgeable. He let us know that the um, chef, the owners, the place has been there for over 29 years. It's all the same chef. And let me tell you, he knows what he's doing. I mean, fantastic. The food was just wonderful. Uh, Johnny felt that we shouldn't go without having the full experience and brought us out their homemade cheesecake and some cannolis and ugh, oh my gosh, absolutely wonderful. The filling inside those cannolis, the taste just amazing. It's like heaven. And the cheesecake, he said, everything is made home, home, homemade, fresh, daily. The cheesecake, the filling for the cannolis, everything. Ugh, wonderful. I thank you, Johnny. I'm so glad we had the dessert. And yeah, it did. It completed the meal. It was the full experience. Definitely going to come back. Um. Like I said, there's two locations, Pasta Mia West on Flamingo, and then there's Pasta Mia East on Tropicana. And the Groupon is for the Pasta Mia West location. So please take advantage of that. And I will say this, 
I don't know how many of you out there, if you've done or taken advantage of the Groupon thing, one thing that you want to do is go on Ebates. It's now called Rakuten. Sign up for it. It is so worth it to get money back for the different places that you shop. It takes a fraction of a second to look. They've even got um, in-store in-store options. Like say if you go to PetSmart, you can get your Ebates, your Rakuten Bates, whatever we want to call it. You can get your Ebates back um, in-store and you just hook it up to one of your cards or whatnot and then it automatically comes back to you and again like i said so worth it so with this particular thing what i suggest is go to rakuten to do the ebates thing and then go to groupon through the rakuten website from there bring up the restaurant area whether you specifically look up Pasta Mia to take advantage of the Groupon special that they've got or whether it's another restaurant you purchase it and then you'll end up getting money back from your purchase that you made so it may only be one percent maybe two percent maybe five percent it just depends on what that particular company is offering so again, a little bit of a savings for you to take advantage of. And, um, you know, if you need any help with it, you need somebody to walk you through it, you know, leave a message, email me, something like that. I'm more than happy to, you know, help you with it. Like I said, it's so worth it. I mean, I've gotten back tons of money, whether I'm shopping on eBay or shopping on Amazon or, you know, shopping at Bath and Body Works, it, they've, you know, or Bed Bath and Beyond, I think theirs is also one that you can hook up to one of your cards you normally use and then get your Ebates back with that. So just a little tip, you know, share with you guys, help you save some money, earn some money back. And um, thanks for watching. And I hope you go and visit Pasta Mia and see Johnny and hit that subscribe button, like it. Please share with your friends, your family, let them know that this is a place to go to eat out. And um, I hope to see you guys next week. Thanks for tuning in. Appreciate the support. Have a good one. Mm -hmm.